Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Callie. I'm a third year law student living in New York City, which is so crazy that I'm a third year. It is Friday. It is like 10 a.m. Um, I like laid in bed for a while. I've also, to be honest, I am trying to film for a TikTok and I have refilmed the intro of me laying in bed like a hundred times, like I'm about to scream. So anyway, I've got to get up. I have a YouTube vlog going up today that I still have to make the thumbnail for and add in the links. And it's also sunny outside and it's supposed to rain for most of the day. So I want to go enjoy the little bit of sun and have coffee on the roof. So we need to get up to make that all happen. So let's get the day started. I just did my skincare and cleaned up all the kitty toys because they spread all of their toys out everywhere at night. I also have to vacuum soon. Put the dishes away. I hate having to put dishes away in the morning. So I usually try to put the dishes away the night before, but like they weren't going to be done till midnight last night so i put them away this morning i just made a fruit salad we did peaches strawberries and banana i don't like to eat banana on its own but in like a fruit salad like this it's usually pretty good so i'm gonna eat this i like to have fruit in like the early morning it's not early morning it's like 10 30 but like i like to have fruit before my actual breakfast because i'm never hungry in the morning but if i drink cold brew on an empty stomach then i have like really bad anxiety so we're gonna eat this fruit and we'll make coffee just made coffee i didn't film it because i feel like you guys have seen it a million times but i got this vanilla agave from the grocery store and it makes such a difference like this is so good better than any of the vanilla syrups so fire i've been putting this in lately and it's really 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 good all right we're gonna go for a walk now i really 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 don't want to because i don't feel well like my allergies are killing me, but we're just gonna go for a short walk. We're gonna walk to Joe and the Juice, get a sandwich, eat it in the park, and come home. I'm in the park right now. I just got my favorite Joe and the Juice sandwich ever. It's honestly like the best sandwich in the world. It is a caprese with avocado, mozzarella, pesto, and tomato. It's literally fire. It's also just so pretty out. Hi besties, this is one of my best friends from law school. First time hanging out in over a year. Yes sir. Um, I hope I don't look a freak. I can't <laughs> anyway, we are trying, we have two more friends from law school coming over soon. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna be trying right now these sparkling margaritas, which usually get like a canned margarita. I can't talk, a canned margarita would gross me out. <laughs> um, but it only has like four ingredients. So we're gonna try it. What does it have in it? <laughs> Are you worried? He's allergic to pecans, he recently found out. Yes, it could kill me. <laughs> There's no pecans. Alright, ready guys? It's gluten free. Okay, cheers Charles. You know what I mean? It's interesting. I mean, it's alright. I don't love it, I don't hate it. Yeah. It's kind of just like there. I don't really taste too much, to be honest. Anyway, I'll put his Instagram um, on the screen. He also has a podcast, which I'll link yeah, thank below. Thank you very much. Um, it's very good. Mm -hmm. Called Melanin Tree. Yep. Yeah, it's just two melanated men talking about the world and whatnot. We're going to have an Instagram up soon. I yeah, and I, I think that it's on Spotify and Apple, or just Spotify? Uh, Spotify, Apple Music, Google, Damn. Apple Podcasts, Google. Okay, yeah. it's on every platform. Remember you recommended all that stuff. I like, did, yeah, I like, did. Get so you should check that out. Also, this man, don't judge his Instagram because he doesn't ever post pictures. We're going to try to get pictures for his Instagram tonight because this man is a handsome young man <laughs> who is a single almost lawyer. So if any of my followers out there are looking for a man, Y'all need to relax. Single lawyer. Handsome yeah, single lawyer. Morning, besties. It is the next day. Um, it was such a fun... I can't talk. It is the next day. It was such a fun night last night. We just drank tequila. 
ate Papa John's, chilled. Um, I'm so happy right now. I went to bed with it pouring last night and I was watching Wizards of Waverly Place while it was pouring and it's still pouring right now. The one bad thing is I don't have an umbrella and it is Saturday so we have to go get a bagel but it is so comfy. I have my rain sounds playing on my um, Google. I always do but also you can't hear the rain so whenever it rains I play rain sounds on all my speakers to really heighten the experience because you can't hear it but look literally just the coziest vibes in here it's pouring outside i love that lamp with the pretty lighting and now all we need is a bagel okay doing a quick little skincare um before i go get my bagel it's literally pouring outside so i probably won't bring you guys with me i don't know why i have not purchased an umbrella it's like beyond me this keeps happening to me like i keep running into situations where i'm like wow an umbrella would be great to have but um still haven't gotten one so but it's saturday and i really want a bagel i've been looking forward to it it's all i can think about and sure i could over eat it but that would be stupid that would be really stupid so we're gonna go get it i'm gonna finish doing my skincare i probably will see you guys next once I've gotten the bagel because I feel like my camera will literally get ruined if I bring you guys with me. But I'll see you guys in a little bit. So good. Every time. Never fails. Salt bagel, scallion cream cheese, fire. I think I'm gonna take a shower really quick before like I actually enjoy this. So this is getting it for TikTok. Um because I just feel really gross and now I'm rained on. I haven't washed my hair for like three days. So I'm gonna go take a shower and then I'm probably just gonna watch like a movie right now and chill for a bit. I might chill all day. So what else do I have to do? All right guys, it is laundry time. I am going to my parents' house for like a few days tomorrow and I like to get like everything pristine before I leave. So then I got all my laundry done and kind of just, I mean my apartment's very clean right now but I'm gonna just deep clean it a little more and yeah, this will probably be like three loads, so this will be fun. So I know I'm a broken record about this, but it's because it really is the best laundry detergent in the world. This has lasted me, it, it still has like at least like four more loads left in it, and I've had this since I moved back to New York, which was like two months ago, three months ago. Wait, yeah, I moved to April 1st, and it's June. Yeah, so this like lasted me two months. Smells so good. 10 out of 10 recommend. It's the best detergent in the world. I'll link it below. Hi guys. I honestly am a little bit hungover, but I have a TikTok that needs to be filmed. The due date is soon, and I'm not going to film it when I go home. I'm going home tomorrow. I already said that. So I'm just looking like a little tired, a little hungover, which is how I feel. So we're going to spruce my face up a little bit so I look presentable for this TikTok. Okay guys, gonna film my TikTok now for the brand. Hopefully they like it. <laughs> this is the TikTok setup. It's a little cloudy, but we're gonna make it work. So if you're curious <laughs> what I filmed, I'm just doing something for fat for fun. I'm not being secretive. Um, but yeah, if you wanna go see it on TikTok, you're welcome to. I'm gonna film this right now and I'll see you guys in a little bit. I always feel like a little nervous like doing brand things because like you know how like my thing is like the face like this is an unboxing and I know that will do a lot better than if I just did an average unboxing and they even say like in the details don't do an average unboxing but like I'm always I always feel awkward doing that for brands but I know like they want me to do what's gonna do the best so I'm just gonna do it but I always feel like awkward sending that into like a professional I don't know it feels weird but I know it's what does best on my channel so that's what we're gonna do Okay, the actual TikTok is filmed. That one was actually, it's so much more fun to actually do TikToks the way you want to do them than like do what you think a brand. Like I feel like I always think like brands have to be more formal and then it's not fun. But the brand doesn't want that as I was saying because it won't do as well. My, like you guys don't want to see like 
videos that feel like ads. No one wants that. So like I just filmed it my style. <laughs> it was actually fun. Now I'm just gonna go on my laptop, read over like the actual guidelines they want for like the captions and stuff, and email that in and hopefully get a nice approval. sent out. Now we are going to make some baked oats for just the TikTok to post for fun because I haven't posted, well I posted one TikTok today but I'm trying to like post a lot, a lot, lot more especially. I don't know if I told you guys this but long story short you're supposed to apply for internships in January. I didn't because I felt so burned out like I physically could not do it. I know that sounds stupid but like I have never been more burned out. Still applying to internships but not sure what's going to happen. So basically, like, if I don't get one, I'm not going to freak out. I'm going to do back-to-back -back internships next semester. It will all be fine or next year. I mean, I'll do one each semester and just focus really, really heavily on building my social media um, and brand this summer. And I think that that's like a legit thing to even put as a blank space on a resume. Does it have to do with law? No, but it does kind of make my resume, it could make it stand out. Um, just because it's something different, so that's the plan, um, but yeah, we're going to make baked oats. I haven't made baked oats before. Um, I've made like obviously the pancakes, but I've never made baked oats, I'm very excited. Okay guys, just a little um, behind the scenes when you guys are like, how do you do that without looking? Um, I don't always. This is really fun. I'm gonna go vacuum that up right now. Okay, I really, really need to get oven mitts, um, but here she is. It smells so good. I'm gonna do a taste test in a second. Um, I'm gonna let it cool first. There's a big chunk out where I put my knife in to see if it was done cooking, but this looks so good. I'll link the recipe below. It was so simple. I think it was just oatmeal, two eggs. I always use more bananas than ask for, so I used three bananas. Baking powder, a little bit of maple syrup, a little bit of cocoa powder, chocolate chips, and, and there you go. It's like a healthier brownie. It is like 5.15. I'm starving. I really, 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 really want to order truffle fries from Westville. But I'm not going to because we have food to make at home. Okay, so we're going to make a Caesar salad, like a really big one. Because I have all this romaine and I want to use... I mean, I feel like I should use all of it. Well, that's a huge salad. Is it really? I don't know. I'm going to wash this, make a salad, and then we'll make something else too. But I'm just trying to use up all my produce. So. Okay, here she is. A beautiful but massive Caesar salad. Like, this is literally an entire bag of romaine. Um, I'm going to eat this, and I think I'm just going to order Westville for their fries because I can't stop thinking about them. I'm just going to get the fries, though. That's it. Okay. Also having a glass of my favorite wine I always talk about, Santa Margarita, Pinot Grigio. Apparently I saw on TikTok this is Drake's favorite wine. So that's cool. But yeah. Alright. I'm gonna go watch a lifetime movie, I think. That's like the vibe. It's like rainy day. I already watched one today. It was pretty I watched one like half of a really cheesy one, and then I watched one based on a true story, but I think I'll watch another one right now and order some fries. Hi guys, hopefully you can hear me over the laundry. Um, I'm so relieved right now. Some grades are out. I just checked them on live with you guys. And yeah, so I thought I failed Crim Pro, like no doubt thought I failed it. Uh, got an A minus. I don't know how. I really don't know how. And I got a pass in Trust in Estates which I, I'm so glad I used my pass for that class because I basically reserved it to not show up as a pass if I got a B or higher and it showed up as a pass so very glad that I used my pass for that class um, now we're just waiting for corporations, trust and estates and entertainment apparently the due date was last night but I'm shocked about Crim Pro. I don't know how that happened I don't know how I got an A-. I'm, my mind is blown, truly blown Like. 
I don't know how that happened. I'm shook to the core. I'm gonna order some fries to celebrate now. I forgot to show you my fries, I think. I'm sorry, I forgot, but they were very, very good. I'm watching like a very cheesy coming to age movie on Hulu right now. Yeah, it's called Plan B. It's actually really, really cute and good. Um, definitely very cheesy, but cute. But I'm craving s'mores. Um, yeah, if you didn't know this about me, like s'mores are one of my favorite desserts in the whole world. Like I love s'more flavor. So I'm gonna make oven s'mores right now, which I like a lot of the instructions are saying to do it on a cookie sheet and like bake them that way. But I'm just going to make individual s'mores into, yeah, like literally just make like s'mores and then wrap them in foil and stick them in the oven for like three minutes. I'm very excited. I've been refreshing the like school grades page literally every two seconds and nothing yet, nothing yet, but. Mm. <sighs> the agony okay here's the setup i'm tiktoking this i feel like this is like the most boring tiktok ever but yeah i'm just have my s'more and i'm gonna put it in foil i can't say if i'm gonna make one or two but i'm not that hungry so i'll probably just make one yeah okay guys she did break because i crushed down too hard but this still looks fire even if it's broken Good morning besties. So I think I told you guys I was planning on driving home today um, but I woke up just feeling like really not well. Like I haven't felt well and I think it's just allergies but just playing extra safe just in case I am sick with anything besides allergies. Um, I don't think it's COVID but of course I get paranoid all the time and I'm vaccinated and I've been so careful. It's either allergies or a cold and I like always get really run down and sick at the end of finals. So yeah, anyway, it's a rainy day. I'm not going home until next week now. I'm just gonna chill here for the week until I feel better and my friend's visiting this weekend. I'm embarrassed. I hate so I'm being really lazy today. That's what I was getting to. I just ordered the butcher's daughter for breakfast because I'm feeling lazy. But I also have an order from Target coming and Instacart order coming. So I I always just like, I literally just went down for a delivery and they really called again. I look like a freak when I order this much, but it's pouring outside, I don't feel well. Anyway, believe it or not, I've never had the Butcher's Daughter before. I've heard like amazing things forever, but I've never had it. So I got a fruit salad. It looks like it's pineapple, watermelon, strawberry, blueberry, and blackberry. Um, I got a green juice because, you know, it's supposed to make you feel better. This is kale, cucumber, green apple, fennel, pineapple, thyme, and blue green algae. Sounds delish. Um, and then... I just got some, it's kind of just like a mix. So it's toast, potatoes, scrambled eggs, avocado, a little salsa. This smells so good, so I'm going to eat this right now. Go ahead and get my order in a second and chill. A little grocery delivery haul. Um, just got some basics. This is my favorite lettuce in the whole world the Little Leaf Crispy Green. It's like, I don't know, it's amazing. Also, carrot chips, if you haven't tried them, they hit different. Like, I love carrots in general, but these are fire. Um, avocados, some strawberries, cauliflower, and yellow onion, because I'm gonna make a cauliflower soup later today. So good, I will, I'm posting a TikTok of it, and I'll also like show it on here as well. Shallots, because you guys know I love shallots. Two peaches some fresh big carrots because I want to make a carrot cake baked oats. It looks so good. Um, zucchini, bananas, and I reordered this because last time I ordered it, it didn't come out of the can. So I'm hoping it comes out this time because it sounds fire. It's coconut um, whipped cream. So like coconut milk. Anyway, I'm going to put this away and then I'm finally going to eat. I have these little bins I keep in my fridge for my veggies because I don't really have a veggie drawer. I only have a cheese drawer. Um, so I just make this work. So this is like my carrot bin and zucchini, lemon. Yeah, and then whatever else. Like I'll put like shallots in the cheese drawer because I feel like, you know, they have an odor. But I'm having a very cute little rainy morning. Also, this green juice, I'm shook, guys. It is the best green juice I've had in my life. Like it does not taste like, you know how green juice is like... They're okay, you can get used to them. Someone who doesn't even like green juice would like this. It's like shocking. I have never had such a 
good green juice in my life. Anyway, I'm going to try to finish this book today. I heated up all my food on a plate because like, I was putting groceries away. It got kind of cold. It's such a cozy vibe today. I'm just watching the rain, eating my breakfast. I don't feel well, but like this is just a very nice morning. Okay, little bath vibes. We have my coffee, my green juice that I haven't finished yet, a candle, and I'm going to watch um the criminal psychology channel on youtube on my ipad and just chill it's a very much self-care day hi guys it's been a while i know i look scary right now i'm doing the loops beauty nighttime mask i just took melatonin it is only 8 a it's 8 p.m not 8 a.m um last time i saw you i think i was in the bath as well um this is my second bath of the day i literally didn't do anything all day I just watched movies and YouTube. Um, I made cauliflower soup. I didn't really film that, so if you want to see the recipe, it's on my TikTok. I just really don't feel well today. I think I'm just really, really run down, and I just got my period too, so that's just like adding to me not feeling good. I hope I just feel better tomorrow. Um, but I mean, it kind of makes sense. I'm not feeling good because I've been like going for drinks with friends like every night. I had like a, like two glasses of wine every night this week, I think. And then like the other night I had like a bunch of tequila with friends. Just has been like a lot of like celebrating. Um, and I just am ready to like be back to eating healthy and making a routine for myself. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna take this bath and then I'm just gonna go to bed really early. Um, I already edited the vlog for tomorrow at like four today, so. I just have to add this clip in and then the vlog will be done but yeah <sighs> all right besties i'm feeling like emotional for no reason and i have been now i know why because i have my period so that's really exciting anyway besties i love you guys so much i hope you enjoyed this vlog uh, make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. It means the world to me and I'm so thankful for each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart. Seriously, I love you guys. Um, I will also link my TikTok and YouTube down below or my YouTube. You guys are on my YouTube. I'll link my TikTok and Instagram down below. If you want to check me out, follow me on there. You can. Um, and besides that, besties. Oh yeah, I'll also link like everything I talked about in this video. But besides that, besties, I'm going to go. I love you guys. I will see you um, on Friday. Have a good week.